All right. Man, oh man. All right. So we have uh, heard through the grapevine that our contractor was going to walk off the job today. And why we don't really know, he's been dragging his feet. We've given him two warnings, and um, apparently he. <laughs> I don't know, this is what contractors do sometimes, just walk There's off. no rhyme or reason. Contractors, no. I always say in a lot of my other stuff that managing contractors is like running an adult daycare, yeah. and it is. Some of them are great, so I don't want to have any hate mail on here. Some of them are great, but by and large, um, we've had a lot of struggles over the years with contractors. But So anyways, now our situation is this. Number one, we have to change the lockbox code, so there's a tip for you. Yep. If you get rid of a contractor, make sure you change your lockbox code and get the key back. That's going to be important, so we'll make sure we do that before yep. we leave. Now we have to evaluate where we are. Hmm. Yeah. We've been in this house before. You may have seen videos before. We've been here before and we were making good progress, but now all of a sudden we've come to a standstill because he was not showing up. Yeah, this, this uh, job dragged on anyway because the inspectors couldn't get here promptly and so now we have contractor yeah. issues. So now we have to really put the push on and get this house done so that we don't lose any more money. So our problem is the contractor's not there and we're gonna have to decide how we're gonna fix, how fast, and who's gonna do it. So let's take a look around and see what needs to be wrapped up. Yeah, totally. Um, see how far along we are. So first coat of paint and skimming has been done, so we need final coat of paint. Yep. A um, little bit of skim work I see up here. Um, kitchen looks like it just needs finished work. We need hardware on. You know, everything else looks like it's in place. Tile is done. This was the Floors first, are this done. Was the first warning the contractor. He, yes. put the, he put the tile in the wrong direction. It it's was supposed, supposed to, be. to be horizontal. <laughs> I walked in and it was vertical. That was the first uh, warning that he had, so. And when stuff like that happens, you gotta make a judgment call. You know, I could either have him rip it out and redo it or leave it as is. And in here, you know, I would have preferred it horizontal, but I don't think it's a deal killer, so I chose to leave it. So hardware on the cabinets, um, that's not that big of a deal. We do need our plumbing fixtures installed. Um, let me take a look over here. You know, most of the paint is done. We just need a final coat. Okay. We need hardware on the doors, vent covers, windows are already installed. I gotta we tell you, for doors. a guy that walked off the job today and actually says he's gonna walk off the job today, he left a lot of tools here. Yeah, and we're changing the lockbox, so if he wants yeah. his tools, he's gonna yeah. have to have a conversation with us. Yeah, we'll give him his tools back, of course, but you got to have a conversation with people before you yeah. just walk off and tell just, everybody else but us. Yeah, and he's, we've had a long relationship with him. For, so for him to just walk off the job and not... Yeah, they get personal problems sometimes. They don't yeah. know how to work through them, so they just, yeah. But it deserves a conversation. But at so, the end of the day, as much as we like him, yeah. this guy, we have a business to run. We do. We, we have, have to make get business deals decisions. Done. Totally. So okay. this, is, so, this is just carpet. Yeah, overall there's, you know... There's not a ton of work to do. We need our vanity in the bathroom. Tile's done, we just need it grouted. Vanity, not not too big okay. of a deal in there. Um, I do want to run upstairs and see what's left up there. Yeah, that we gotta see. The deck, we have to finish the deck too. That was, that, was that on him or another, another company? No, that was supposed to be on him. Okay. Look out for the ladder. Pretty much the same thing. We need carpet in here, we need closet doors, and to finish the paint. Does he lay in the carpet? No. Oh, for the sake of it, that's not part no, of the no, job. No, 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 no. Okay. No. All right, this bathroom needs a little more work. This bathroom needs yeah. all the tile work done, vanity, toilet. So this, yeah, all that's gotta get trimmed out. A little bit of work. Yeah, a okay. little bit of work. That's the biggest project I see so far. Yeah, and this is just paint and carpet. And doors. So let's talk about it. So our budget, I checked before we come over here, our budget left is three thousand we had three thousand dollars left in yep. the year. It's three thousand dollars worth of work, pretty close. Pretty close I'd say. It depends on who we're gonna get and how quickly we can get the Yeah, it makes a big difference. So when you're looking for contractors, it's gonna make a difference on when they can get here. So sometimes if somebody is a little more expensive but they can get here today right. or tomorrow, that's better than somebody that could be here a thousand dollars less but starts in two weeks because you have holding costs on a property and that, that adds up. I mean, they, that eats your profit and it takes right out of your bottom line. So we've got calls to make. We do. So let's uh, let's grab our phones, let's start making some phone calls. Let's do it from here and get some people out here. Let's see who we can get here yep. right away to start. Agreed. Okay. I'll call Chris. Let's see how we do. Thomas Contract. Hey, Chris, hey, it's Glenn Schwarm of uh, Signature Home Buyers. How you doing? Good, how are you? 
Good. Hey, listen, we, we have a situation. Amber and I are in a house right now that we, a uh, contractor has walked off the job. We're not sure why, or after his medical reasons or whatever. He just, we heard he's not gonna be here, so he's not here. We've got probably about, what do you think, two weeks? I think it's about two weeks worth of work. Yeah, it's about two weeks worth of work. It's a lot of finished work. The only thing that's really intensive is a bathroom that needs to have tile, toilet installed, that kind of stuff. And then the final touch up, you know, I know it takes a little bit of time, but um, got a tight budget. I, I want to see what your availability is. What are you, what are you in the middle of? What do you, I mean, you, what do you got? And, and is this something you want to tackle? It's not a huge project. What do you want to do? Uh, sure. Yeah, it's over in Rotterdam. Uh, so the bathroom's gonna be tiled. It's a it's a shower, right? It's a full bath. So the shower needs to be tiled. The floor needs to be tiled. The vanity set, the toilet set, and paint and light fixtures. Yeah. Um, and then the rest of the house. Um, plumbing's there. Plumbing's there. Yeah, all the rough ends already done. So the rest of the house already has first coat of paint, and it's already been skin coated to um, fill in any problems. So we need a final coat of paint on the whole house. Um, we need okay. hard hardware on the doors, hardware on the cabinets. Um, paint is probably the biggest part of the job, other than the bathroom. Chris, okay. it's probably about a it's probably about a fourteen hundred square foot house, so not you huge, know, yeah. average size house. But okay, so not too big. no, no. I mean, I guess my question is, you know, assuming we can meet, we can agree on numbers. It's time, really, for us. No one's no one's right. in the job right now, and the clock is ticking. So. Any chance of getting a crew out here soon? Or I know you have to look at the house first, but. Yeah, so just uh, top of my head, you know, I always try to help you any, any way that I can. Uh, I'm looking at about you know, two weeks, two weeks at least right now. Two weeks Maybe, at least, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Are you finishing up something now? All right. Yeah, I have just, you know, it's just fucked up, you know how it is, but I yeah. have to try to squeeze you in. Um, well, I don't know how much I can, but I'm. I'm I'll tell you what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be fair, I'm gonna text you over the code, I'll text you the address and the code. Come, just, if, could you take a quick look at it today, you think, is that possible? Yeah, I can do that, I can find that works. That, that's fine, yeah, come, take a quick look at it, and then we can have a, a you know, kind of a better conversation when you know more about it, but, but two, sure. weeks, two weeks is your deal, so good. All right, Chris, I agree. Yeah. Go ahead, what's that? I wish I could do better, but I can't, that's all I can do. No, I, I understand, I'll, uh, yeah, let me, let me text you over the information now, and we'll talk later. Thanks, Chris. That's it. Bye. So, all right. So, two weeks. Um, I've got a couple other guys I can call too. All right. Let's find out. All right. So, just a little tip of the day here. One thing that I do is when I put the contact in my phone, I actually put what they do right there. So, all of these people are contractors. So, all I have to do in my search field is type in contractor or plumber or painter, and I just pull them all up because it's so hard to remember all their names. So. I'm so, gonna call John. So our job right now is to try and find someone that can get this job done. I mean, start right away. Right. Today, today is Thursday, so realistically, not tomorrow. I mean, if they can start, that'd be great. But realistically, realistically, it's Monday, Monday. Yeah. Let's see. Someone's got to be available. All right. The weather's starting to turn, so they're not quite as busy. Let me call John. John? Hey John, it's Amber. How you doing? Good. How are you doing? Not so good. I'm hoping you can help me. <laughs> so uh, all right. what we, can help you with? we have a house that we just walked in and we found out our contractor walked off the job. You know how you guys are. <laughs> yep, yep. So, I, I know exactly what you're talking about. Now you would never do that, I know. But no, of course some not. of you guys are like that. Yeah. So, so I you know we need to get this job done as soon as possible, obviously. I kind of want to see like where you're at in work mode. Like, you know, if, if we were to give you a job, how quickly you could get to it. Okay, uh, I am currently on a job site right now and that is about to be wrapped up. Oh. Um, we do have a small project coming up next week, um, but this, I'd have to check my schedule and see if I can get out there. Okay, so this, you know, my, my job's not huge. The bulk of the work has been done. It's mostly some finished work. Um, there is one bathroom, so it's a, about a 1,400 square foot house. It's um, four bedrooms, two baths. One of the bathroom just needs grouted and the plumbing set, and then the second bathroom does need to be tiled, painted, um, and have every, all of the fixtures set. And then the rest of the house is really just paint and some finish work, put the doorknobs on, put hardware on the cabinets, that sort of thing. But by and large, the, the job is done. We just need it finished. 
So, you know, it's, it's probably about, for, for a crew your size, it's probably about a two week job. You okay. think, you, think yeah. you could bump that other job and squeeze me in first? Well, let's... Uh, I could probably come out and see it on Monday. Okay, any, any chance you could swing by today? Like maybe when you go to lunch or something? Uh, you know what? Uh, my guys are pretty good here. I pretty sure I can set in during today. Okay, that would be awesome. I will text you over the lockbox code and the address. You come in, take a look around. You know our work. You've worked for us before, so you know you know what my expectations yep. are and everything. So, our, our, and by the way, our budget's about three thousand dollars. That's what we All have right. left to work with. So, see if you can get it done. Um, if that budget works for you, we're ready to rock and roll on Monday, or sooner, okay. or sooner if you can. Okay. All right. I'll text you, and then we'll talk later after you come see it. That sounds good. All right. Thank you. Thanks, John. Uh, Bye. No problem. Thank you. No problem. All right. Okay. Um, okay, so let's let's kind of go about our day, and we'll when we get phone calls back, we'll have a conversation and see where we go. And if we can get someone started here Monday, yeah, then that's what we do. We'll He's good. He's started. always been good to us, so I'm yes. hoping that'll work out. Okay. All right. Let's uh, let's go back to the office. Okay. Okay. All right. So John and Chris could not get it done. Um, they called us back. They have prices, but they, they can't get started for about two weeks. So Amber is here with Rick, and Rick showed up right away, so let's see what Rick's got for us. So Rick and I just walked through the house to see the scope of work and what all needs to be done. Now we have to talk numbers. Yes, we do. So I've got about three grand left in the budget. That's what we were going to pay the guy that walked off the job. That's what's left. What, do you, what can you do this for? I'm looking around five. Ugh, five. You're killing yeah. me, Rick. I know. It's what do you, a lot of work. Yeah, what do you so, think is the biggest, the biggest part? The biggest part? It's probably the bathrooms and we take the whole house over. Oh, the whole house. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I guess we do the whole house, right? Where we got to be. So, you know, we've always been really good to you. You don't have to fight us for money. When the work is done, we cut the checks. We're, we're a very easy client to work with. Yes. I'm at three. You're at five. Yes. Do you think there's any way we could meet in the middle at four and call it a day and get it done? We can do that. And yeah? Right, yes, one one more favor, though. I know that you, you're looking here. Um, when could you start? I could start today, tomorrow. Today, done. That no works, right? All right? We good? That sounds good to me. Thank good you, Rick. Kid. All right, awesome. All right. Perfect. All right, so thankfully, because we have a network of contractors that we constantly do business with, I was able to keep calling and keep dialing, and we found Rick, and he was able to start the job right away, and that's gonna save us a lot of time and money in the long run. So he was about $1,000 more than we wanted to pay that was in the budget, but the truth is, every day you hold a house costs more money, and so if he could start today, and that's, yeah. a, big, that's a big factor. He's like to start today, He's in. He's already here. He's got guys loading stuff up the driveway. We're rocking and rolling. So he's going to come in and finish this job, and that means everything to us. So, okay. A little bit of work today, but after all that, another save.